What they've done here is build a straw man. They have created a fake Alex Jones, and they are putting words in his mouth. They can't find anywhere where I have said that I know the kids killed at Sandy Hook were actors or that it didn't even happen. That's how advanced all this is. And I'm not saying that happened at Sandy Hook. I'm saying it was a drill, a giant piece of theater. Did they and, you know, all Mr. Wade had to do is pick up the phone. I mean, I don't understand. He's an investigator. He knows how to investigate. I looked at his credentials, you know, all of his awards and certificates that he got. Hello, welcome everyone to Sandy Hook Facts and SandyHookFacts.com. I am your host, C.W. Wade. You know, I don't want this to have ever happen, but I wish it was real instead of fake. That is a hundred times more scary. Okay, Hillary Clinton recently accused Alex Jones of essentially being a Sandy Hook hoaxer. Alex Jones made numerous videos in response denying it. Uh, Alex Jones' denials are lies. He is a obvious Sandy Hook hoaxer. This is a video collage of comments made by Alex Jones during three different interviews with Wolfgang Haubig, the leader of the Sandy Hook hoaxer group. I think his words speak for themselves, so let's put those words out there. They have created a fake Alex Jones, and they are putting words in his mouth. They can't find anywhere where I have said that I know the kids killed at Sandy Hook were actors or that it didn't even happen. I've hosted debates between people who say the story's true 100% and those that say the whole thing is a fabrication. So he's just hosted debates, huh? Not just one, but a bunch of parents doing this. And then photos of kids that are still alive, they said died. I mean, they think we're so dumb that... Nanza and then to bring in all the actors to break down and cry. And then think we're so stupid they even use the same actors as different people. I mean, all I know is we've all seen the footage. And Let's listen to what Hillary had to say. It's also what happens when you listen to the radio host, Alex Jones, who claims that 9-11 and the Oklahoma City bombings were inside jobs. He even said, and this really just is so disgusting. <laughs> you, he you even hear said Alex the Jones victims laugh right of there. the Sandy Hook massacre were child actors, and no one was actually killed there. I, I don't know. Funny. What happens in somebody's mind or how I, I, dark I don't know. How did you say that? I just didn't call those Christians. I don't know. To say things like that. I didn't that. say that. But Trump doesn't challenge these Gaza. lies. Trump he doesn't. actually went on Jones's show and said, your reputation is amazing. I will not let you down. <laughs> they hate this that. from the man who wants to be Okay, so let's see if Alex Jones is lying in his denials. Yes, I do say that was a false flag completely. There's different types of false flags. Uh, and then they say that I say Sandy Hook massacre, that none of it happened. Got attacked when they weren't. Remember, that's famous. I just said it should be investigated. Clearly, the whole story doesn't add up. Some people say it's all child actors. Some people say all this. When they weren't. Remember, that's famous. I just said it should be investigated. Clearly, the whole story doesn't add up. Alex claims all he said was it should be investigated. Looking for a big PR bonanza and then to bring in all the actors to break down and cry and then think we're so stupid they even use the same actors as different people. Looking for a big PR bonanza and then to bring in all the actors to break down and cry and then think we're so stupid they even use the same actors as different people. But a bunch of parents doing this and then photos of kids that are still alive they said died. I mean, they think we're so dumb that it's 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 really hidden. So in he's plain obviously view. pushing these same old tired memes. As all other, you know, I don't want this to ever happen, but I wish it was real instead of fake. That is a hundred times more scary. Attempt to spin it and claim that we're blaming firefighters or police and claiming the whole government was involved is a fraud. Criminal traitors like Hillary Clinton. Attempt to spin it and claim that we're blaming firefighters or police and claiming the whole government was involved is a fraud. And if you've got control of the FBI and the agencies and the media, that you get them all involved in the corruption up front. 
And I guess they just picked a group of state police and others that they knew they had under their control, compromised. I don't know, uh, pro, you know, pro gun controllers, fellow travelers. I mean, attempt to spin it and claim that we're blaming firefighters or police and claiming the whole government was involved is a fraud. And I guess they just picked a group of state police and others that they knew they had under their control, compromised. I don't know, uh, pro, uh, you know, pro gun controllers, fellow travelers. So disgusting. He even said the victims of the Sandy Hook massacre were child actors and no one was actually killed there. I don't know what happens in somebody's mind or how dark their heart must be to say things like that. Now there are 20 dead bodies, you got adults, you got the shooter killed himself, and people are eating lunch inside the same And they're street. ordering porta potties. Anybody that knows, you see one dead kid, you don't eat for a day, you go home, you cry, you throw up. You don't right. go have lunch by their dead, splattered bodies. Hey, you go home, you cry, you throw up. You don't right. go have lunch by their dead, splattered bodies. All right, so that's completely fabricated. It's a false, it's oh, a no. lie. What happens in somebody's mind or how dark their heart must be to say things like that? You don't go have lunch by their dead, splattered bodies. I age that is that good. Yeah, because a lot of times you shoot somebody in the head, it'll still deviate. Or the, or the heart, it'll deviate. I mean, it's, it's, it's like hunting. You can shoot a deer right in the head sometimes. It doesn't kill them right away. Uh, this is a child with autism, and if there's one thing we know about children with autism, they have very poor motor coordination and skills. I and they tend know. to get distracted off at each event. Yep. No, they just picked a mentally ill person to patsy out. All right, Wolfgang, we're going to have you back on. Give out that website one more time. Yep. No, they just picked a so mentally ill person to patsy that he out. calls a uh, animal a patsy. It's just, you're disgusting, Alex Jones. The black heart. Yep. No, they just picked a mentally ill person to patsy out. We don't, I don't know exactly what went on. I just know as an investigator, a lay investigator, that the official story is not true, so we're being lied to. That the official story is not true, so we're being lied to. Would they stage this? I don't know. Do penguins live in Antarctica? Gov. No one died in 2012 in Sandy Hook. It, it shows no homicides in that town. Well, I know this. I've seen CNN and others run hoaxes. I've seen the White House do it, and it's getting more blatant. So I think something would be wrong with us not to question all these. And then you look at the green screens and the and just the lies and the fake videos and you're really sure though nobody died it was a total cutout i'm telling you nobody died it is the filthiest the most deplorable school that i as a principal have ever seen sure it was only used as a cutout it had been closed until right before they reopened it for this for this for this event sure it was only used as a cutout it had been closed until right before they reopened it for this for this for this event and by the way, the reward for proof the school was open with the photos they requested have been claimed. And right now the hoaxers are refusing to pay. So that's pretty sickening, but expected. There, they just laugh at him. And you look at the videos of the kids walking in circles in and out for the news cameras, and they come right out a minute later, and it's the same one. There, they just laugh at him. And you look at the videos of the kids walking in circles in and out for the news cameras and they come right out a minute later it's the same so he one. jumps right on blaming the kids and making a disgusting lie of a claim on a long ago debunked thing now skeptics erroneously have attempted to denounce this evidence as manufactured and looped by youtube Man, looks like that. that's all there is to it that's, that's all there is to it a winner just like that that's all there is to it and yes, folks, that is all there is to it. They took a couple of seconds, a moment in time, and looped it over and over to create the er illusion of recycling. Then they added music, and they added arrows. The key to exposing the loop is to watch the gray car in the top left corner. We're going to count off the number of loops used in We Need to Talk About Sandy Hook. Other videos use them. Now, skeptics erroneously what? have attempted to denounce this evidence as manufactured and looped by YouTubers. 
Yet, as we can see, before the helicopter video pans out, the people are just filing right back into the firehouse. Yes, arrows were given out by various YouTubers to show the characters looping around. And yes, songs were attributed to the edited versions of the videos to clearly show how ludicrous it all is. And yes, the video is played forward and backward right before it pans out to show clearly where the people are headed. But this tape quite clearly is not looped and we can clearly see people walking in circles. Can you handle that? 18 loops he used. Well with a straight face telling you this video is clearly not looped. If there would have been just two or three lawsuits filed by the parents or loved ones who lost someone that day at Sandy Hook, I'd go away. Of course, well. oh, there'd be a hundred lawsuits right now. I didn't even think of that. Well, there's no lawsuits. It's like a Manhattan Project simulation hoax. I already filed. Calling it a simulation hoax. At Sandy Hook, I'd go away. Oh, there'd be there'd be a hundred lawsuits they aren't right going now. Away, I didn't even think of that. Well, there's no lawsuits. It's like a Manhattan Project simulation hoax. I already filed. Uh, and then they say that I say Sandy Hook massacre, that none of it happened. Well, Alex, when you call it a simulation, a hoax, and a drill, then uh, that means you're saying it never happened. It's like a Manhattan Project simulation hoax. I already five more minutes. Well, according to FBI crime statistics at FBI.gov, no one died in 2012. In Sandy Hook, it, it shows no homicides in that town. And that story by Adon Salazar is online at Infowars.com. We'll put that on screen, show some screenshots of those statistics for TV viewers. So Alex Jones jumped right on a meme that the hoaxers push, and that is the claim that the FBI published a report saying no one died in Sandy Hook. And... What they did was they only looked on one page of the report and they didn't look at the whole report. So this was debunked. And so I'm going to let Joel debunk this as he did a great job. In this video, I'm going to show how Jim Fetzer and Wolfgang Halbig Obviously, uh, have been Alex blatantly Jones has lying the staff that could to their viewers look at the other page regarding the, report. the FBI so report. This was an intentional lie and disinformation no by Newtown. Alex Jones in 2012. Now let's get going right directly to the report that is uh, always shown. Now this is the Uniform Crime Reports from the FBI. Table 8. This is always what is shown by people claiming this. Now if you go to um, the bottom of the second page you see Newtown listed. And under the uh, category of murders, there is zero. Now, I agree there should be an asterisk there and some sort of reference point. But someone didn't do that, or for whatever reason, you can go ask the FBI why they did it this way. However, if you go to table 11, it's another table in the report, it shows Connecticut State Police and a category of murder and non-negligent manslaughter and the total is 36. That is the location of the Sandy Hook murders. They were put under the state because it was a state investigation. It was a large mass murder put under the state police control, the Connecticut State Police CSP. I'm including this because it's Alex Jones lying about Wolfgang Halbig and bolstering his already bolstered uh, self-promoting resume. But Wolfgang W. Halbig was a state police officer, then a customs uh, enforcement officer. Never been any proof he's an enforcement major officer. University security, and then he runs one of the biggest uh, school security. And he never worked at college, any university, uh, but, but also uh, that we've ever seen or know of. Twelve uh, security programs. So Alex Jones uh, made that up. featured. Um, what they've done here is build a straw man. You're a liar. They have Alex created Jones. a fake Alex Jones, and they are putting the words real in Alex his mouth. Alex Jones is a liar. They can't find anywhere where oh, I have yeah. said that I know. The kids killed at Sandy Hook were actors. You said it's a hoax. Or that it didn't even happen. 
I've hosted debates no, between people host who debate. say the story's true 100% and those that say the whole thing is a fabrication. So the only debate that they've ever hosted was by Rob Dew. So, I mean, it is Alex Jones's channel, so he gets the credit. But it was not Alex Jones. It was Robert Dew. Right. Absolutely. Well, we were denied to be in the courtroom because we're not mainstream media, but we will be waiting out here for you to find out. Well, let's take a look at what his other reporters have also done. You know, if he wants to take the credit for Rob Dew, then he can take the credit for Dan Bidondi. Uh, you know, the hearing officer heard it. There goes Mr. Frank. Yeah. How does it feel covering up Sandy Hook, you criminal? We know about your background, too. You're a criminal. The pocket, I found nine of these uh, Sandy Hook ducks on my car. Somebody just put them on my car. You believe that? Ah, Lee, I, my granddaughter's going to like this. <laughs> thank Take you. home as a seven yeah, Thank you. I can't believe <laughs> I it. I found nine of those on my car. I mean, like... Well, somebody loves you and they know you're here. <laughs> You serve the federal criminals. How do you feel about that? You know, you're this guy here is somebody out of Central Casting. I'm telling you, this is the accusing the known attorney of being from Central Casting. Sandy Hook truth is coming out. You act. People this is this you is outrageous lies pushed by Alex Jones and his staff. Look at credentials. Dan Bedani, Infowars.com, the number one alternative news source in the world. Yeah, live right on the roof. Live right on the air. What do you have to say about the federal criminals? How do you guys feel before, but the biggest report ever issued on any mass shooting was by Connecticut on Sandy Hook. You got nothing to hide, just speak to us. Have fun in jail, special. criminal. Truth is out there. You're going to jail, criminal. Oh, Have fun with your retirement. There's a, there's a reporter telling telling cops that they're going to go to jail. But make no mistake about it, you will be going to jail. You're a bunch of frauds, a bunch of criminals. Enjoy your Federal Reserve notes now, scumbags. Now, it, see those people, folks? They're covering up Sandy Hook. So there's Hawk. Alex Jones. Yeah, there's the staff. They're covering up Sandy Hook in the police chief in that car right there. Just sickening. You might as well just, just go all the way bald. You're 79% there. Tactics. Yes, I do say that was a false flag completely. There's different types of false flags. Uh, and then they say that I say Sandy Hook massacre, d that none of it happened. I just said it should be investigated. Clearly, the whole story doesn't add up. Some people say it's all child actors. Some people say all this. Okay, so there you have it. So, uh, you know, his words speak for himself. He, he didn't just call for an investigation, and he didn't just host a debate he he went well beyond that so um he is quite obviously lying he is obviously a sandy hook hoaxer and um while he didn't say the words in the exact manner that he claims he didn't say them so he's parsing the words very very carefully the impression and the idea and what he's trying to convey that Sandy Hook was a hoax, the children were actors, and were walking in circles. He, he makes that very, very clear. So he, he actually can't deny it. And so there you have it. His own words, his own shows, his own reporters. And there is the real Alex Jones, and he is exposed as a Sandy Hook hoaxer that he is. This is C.W. Wade, SandyHickFacts.com. We'll catch you on the next one. What they've done here is build a straw man. They have created a fake Alex Jones, and they are putting words in his mouth.